him too much because he's a very old timer. He was 87 years old and uh, he passed away uh, the 31st of August. So today we want to remember him because this guy was very good. He was born in Peru. He came to the United States and he got married to his wife and they have a almost 10 kids, wow. uh, okay, and uh, his wife is 90 years old, she's still alive, and uh, Alfredo, he was a professor of mathematics in the school, high schools, and he worked almost uh, 15 years making the Fullerton Arboretum of CRG Garden. He plants so many plants in there, you know, with the members of the Orange County chapter. And then the best part of him, he was going every week, twice, a, twi two, two days a week, watering the plants for almost 12, 15 years. Mm -hmm. So those plants, they have survived actually thanks to him. He was very good man. And he specialized mostly in Lukma. You know, because he's from Peru, so Lukma is a native fruit from Peru. So he introduced actually the Lukma uh, fruit into the United States, I think, 25 years ago. He planted one tree in the Arboretum. And right now, the tree is still alive and produces a lot of fruit. And he actually pushed very hard with this Lukma. So then I, I work with him a lot in this particular fruit. I have in here growing 10 of these trees of Lukma. And different varieties? Yes, there are three types. They are uh, the Kona, the uh, Seda, and the Palo. The Seda is the most soft to eat. The Palo is mostly to make ice cream, and the Kona is soft to eat uh, from Hawaii. And uh, he specialized so much and worked so hard in the Lukma, you know, and in his house, he has in front of his house, he has two huge trees. In front of the house, actually, in the sidewalk, producing a lot, a lot of fruit. Matter of fact, this fruit that you see in here, he, his wife, sent it with a friend of us to here to show it to you the work that he specialized. You're going to have a chance to taste today uh, look my ice cream, because you can make excellent ice cream from this, and uh, so you will know so much about this particular look man, because it's a brand new, not too many people growing, and uh, it's excellent fruit, as you can see and you can taste it. Well, I want to uh, say uh, a name of Alfredo. Can you please make a prayer for at least one minute yourself, pray for his soul, because I am very sure he's working in heaven, creating a wonderful garden, you know, and helping the heaven to be green, because he loves plants always, and he was an excellent guy. Okay, so please pray for him, at least half a minute. All right, thanks a lot. And uh, as you see him, Macy, mostly of you don't know him because you know, he was very old. He was 87 when he passed away. And uh, mostly the problem we have in CRG is all the old timers yeah, that they used to like work so hard for us, they die. And you know, I'm glad we have a young generation in here that they can replace us as good. Yes. And keep on loving the plants and keep CRG going all the way up. <laughs> Thank you so much. And now we're going to be talking about. Uh, the fruits that 